Joseph, now a slave, has been bought by Potiphar, the Pharaoh's chief steward. Thanks to you, Joseph, my house is in order for the first time in ten years. I am pleased that you're satisfied with my work, my lord. I'm more than satisfied, Joseph. You're brighter than my other slaves. You catch on quickly. You can read and write. My father taught me. I feel like I can trust you, Joseph. Tell me, do you think you can handle even more responsibility? Yes, sire. You're in charge of my household, then. I will do my best to serve, my lord. Is there something you want, mistress? Yes, I need assistance in my personal quarters. Your quarters? You're not afraid to be alone with me, are you? I, uh... Come on, then. How can I serve you, mistress? Let me count the ways. <laughs> I've had my eye on you for some time, Joseph. I think you've had your eye on me, too. Don't be ashamed to confess your desire for me. I, um... <clears throat> I, I think that, uh, that I should get back to work. If it's my husband you're worried about, I sent him on an errand. He'll be gone for hours. Um, I, I don't mean to offend you, but I, I... I really must go. Don't you find me attractive, Joseph? Oh, yes, but... Kiss me. I, I, I can't. Potiphar trusts me. If you serve him, you serve me, too. Take me in your arms and kiss me, Joseph. I order you to. I, I... I can't. Then I'll tell my husband you did anyway. He'll have you thrown in jail. Have you ever been inside an Egyptian jail, Joseph? Please, don't do this. If you fight me, Joseph, you lose. Give in. Don't you see? You have no choice. You'll pay for that.